These are quite a quite a buoyant lure. These lure these old mates with the stumpies, so you can walk them over the logs pretty well. Ooh, I had a I had a strike. See the boil out there? I was just thinking again, like earlier before, it felt unnatural. And then I looked up and there's a boil. I'm thinking, I'm sure that was a fish. It didn't strike it, so I didn't feel any weight, so he, he could come back if I'm lucky. You hit it, you'll see a boil again in a second. Yeah, there it is. Oh, he's, <laughs> he's only, really, well, he's not even really hitting it, he's just really, really gently. Like, you just feel like an electric shock come up the line almost. This time I've cast about three foot away from him. That wasn't intentional. Go oh, hit it again. Got him! <laughs> oh, how's that? Well Look at how small he is. Well A little Murray cod on the old mate lure. Oops. Little Murray cod caught on the old mate lure. Now I'll put a link in the description below this video to where you can find these old mate lures. But he came out there, he hit it, then he hit it again, then he hit it again, he hit it three times and then he disappeared. So I made a few casts into another part of the hole and then I came back 10 minutes later and had another couple more casts. Ready, here he goes. See ya buddy. So he hit it three times and then he stopped. So I fished the rest of the bend up here and around the front there and then I came back here 10 or 15 minutes later and it still took me three or four casts but eventually he came out and hit the old mate oh not the um they oh yeah what are those fish that are real popular down there the, uh, Mulloway Mulloway yeah but there's another one the big yellow fish no what are they one of the best, best ones fishing the sea marlin or something no not marlin no. tuna <laughs> Whales? <laughs> oh, I'm on. Oh, finally. Well done, Mr. Corker. Would you like to lend us some pliers? Yeah, I think I've got some here. He's bigger than mine. Mine wasn't very big at all. <laughs> You can hear all your diet cake cans rustling around in the back of your bag. Yeah, diet cake more. <laughs> <laughs> no blackies. <laughs> I'm just going to, I'm going to lift him out of the water. Just light him up for a tick. What's it that's been about something? That's a native. That's a native spinnerbait. A native spinnerbait. Well done, Brent. Thanks, mate. Not a monster, but he's a nice little no, fish. He's no. bigger than the one I've got before. He's quite a fat little bugger. I'll just tangle him for you. That's the sort of mate that I am. I'll just quickly, quickly, quickly get the lure out. There he goes. Thanks. He gave you a splash on the face. That's the goo kiss. That's it. Now it's going to happen now. Well, that's going to turn the corner, I reckon. They're about to just come on. I wish it looks good just in here, but I've never caught a fish here. Oh, on the surface! I oh, shit, I oh, shit you not! Oh, I'm gonna have to swim after that. That is wrapped around 50,000 million logs. The moment that hit, I don't even know whether I've still got the fish. 
you still on? Fish, yeah, yeah, I know. The moment that hit the water, bang! Before I even clicked it into gear, oh, he just got off. Oh, he just got off. He was a good fish. Yeah. I reckon he was a good 50 to 55 centimeter yeah, fish. Sure. He was close to a legal fish. How's that? I cast a little old mate out. That's just hit the water, bang! Straight away. I did not even click it into gear. And you said you've never caught a fish in there, bang. Well that was actually, I was just about to open my mouth and say I'll be surprised if I get this lure back. I'd gone over all those trees, those branches and why, how exciting was that? Brett's just hooked up. I'm sitting up here changing lures. I'm about to put a surface lure on and I hear this boof. Like oh. I hooked him in the ass. <laughs> yeah. You've hooked him in the backside, Brett. Well, what if I stick the old grippies in? Yeah, I'll do a bit. Just be careful, don't slap you, because be careful with that lure goes running. I know. <laughs> Last thing you want that in your hand. You want a yes. pair of pies? Yes, he's right, mate. I've got some here, thanks. Yeah. Sitting up there changing lures, going from a uh, going from a hard body to a surface lure. <laughs> I heard this. Oof! You hit it good. <laughs> That's a fair hit. <laughs> It's not quite where I wanted to hook him. <laughs> I'll be careful here that I don't end up with Yeah, no, just be very careful, bro. He's got a serious case of lockjaw. Right. I've got it in. It's unfortunate that you've got to sometimes prize their mouth open to get the, the hook in. Oh. But I think, I think our own safety is more important yeah. than the fish. What do you think? Let me put him straight back. Put him straight back. I want to say this quickly, you can see his gills are just starting to flare out a little bit here now. That means he's very, very stressed and he needs to go. Thank you, sir. Well done, Brent. Thanks, mate. I'm just standing up there changing lures. <laughs> I hear this poof. Yeah. <laughs> right at the same spot where I had one on a surface lure. The old dead hand. The dead hands yeah. technique. I get mine on a, uh, an old mate lure, not a surface lure, but. This is where he come out of, bro. Right there. I hooked a fish there on a surface lure, on a sur oh no, an old mate diving lure on the surface and we both said at the same time, that's it, let's put surface lures on and within two minutes you've hooked up. Yep. You the man. I'll go and finish this mission of changing lures. <laughs> what do you reckon, a big Jetson cast right up the guts? Whoa, something followed that out then. You see that? Frighten the crap out of me. It would have been a cod. That was with my lure. I just lifted my lure up just there, and something came up and buffed it just as I lifted it out. <laughs> I'm coming around. <laughs> I've got a funny feeling I'm going to be swimming over there to you in a minute. <sighs> oh, I've got that. <laughs> Oh, and again! You got him. Well done, Brett. You're the man. Three buffs. Dead hands. Dead hands. Dead hands. Dead hands. Dead hands. Dead hands. <laughs> really? I'm going to try and come over there, but it's very hard going out here. Yeah, this sand is very sinky. Uh-oh. What's that? I'm going to have to swim across there. <laughs> well done, Brett. He's a really nice fish. Look at this. <laughs> Oh, well done, Brett. I'll come over. Do you want to get a photo? Yeah, thanks. Yeah. Put it on Instagram. No worries. I'm going to swim back out to that island, he's gone. Well done, Mr. Corker. The best fish of the night by quite a long way. <laughs> he buzzed yet. <laughs> oh, I did too, look. 
Can I get a photo, please? Nah, no, you're right, mate. It's only small. Oh, yeah. I don't know. It's thick, mate. Little trouty. Oh, it is trouty. Well done. Yeah, so you've got to get one of them there, but... Lovely little trout cod. Now, Brett unselfishly said to me, you have a go there, I'm going to stand back because he just caught a nice 50 centimetre cod. And he said, Hugo. Hugo first, while I wait. Isn't he just a wonderful man? And Brett was right on the money. There was a fish exactly where he said there was going to be one. See ya, buddy. A lovely little trout cod taken on the depth buzz jet. Quite like this, Will.